new morgue unit has been bought and paid for and is being transported as I speak. I don't know the exact figure, but it would. It, I think it's in the hundreds of thousands of dollars. I don't know if it's 300000 I don't know if it's half a million. I'm not sure. But it's a very expensive unit. That, I think, the funds from that was from central government. I, I'm not sure about the details. Um, we There have been funds allocated to an upgrade of the morgue. There is a plan for the morgue. And I know the pathologist who, is, who serves both the KHMH as well as the government is part of the person designing and getting that together. Um, that can and, and, and we had, I, I think there was a group, I think the group was from a British related group, I don't know if it had to do with the British Army or whoever, had come and visited sometime I think last year or earlier this year having to do with trying to help adopt the, the to adopt the morgue. Certainly. When the unit is totally mm -hmm. outfitted mm -hmm. to complement the current one, mm -hmm. How many more bodies can it accommodate on it? I think it should be a doubling of the capacity. At Which least, is at least. What? I think we have. A if it's not overcrowded, I, I should. Yes, I, I, I think we should have a capacity for about at any one time about. I think about twenty bodies. Yeah. That's when it's not overcrowded. That's when it's not overcrowded. That that number can easily double. Mm -hmm.